Yo, what's up guys? Before we get into this beautiful vlog, we want to address something really, really serious. We just want to be completely vulnerable with you guys and we want to explain to you guys a situation that we've been dealing with for the past month. As you guys know, a few weeks ago, we announced that we were going to do a new merch drop and we've been wanting to give you guys like some fire you know we announced it on our instagrams on our youtube as many of you guys know we had to cancel that merch drop and we kind of couldn't really tell you guys why because we were dealing with something and we didn't really know if we should have told you guys why not but this is the reason what happened so we dropped hats in february literally within 20 minutes it sold out thank you guys so much for that support and then a lot of people wanted more hats and so we we're like yo let's do a restock one more time for the hats and you know see how it goes crazy love again so much support we appreciate it once again for selling out the hats we were ready to go on to the next step of dropping shirts for our third ever drop, third merch drop. We were working with these guys, those shady people that we had to unfortunately deal with because we wired them over $23,000 so we can move on to the next step of dropping shirts for you guys. And we needed the samples and the shirts done by a certain date so that we can start promoting our shirts, our brand, our merch for you guys. They weren't meeting us with the date requirements. When they did come out with the samples, the samples were awful. The details, everything, the color, everything was awful. It got to a point where we were like, yo, we no longer want to work with you guys because it's very unprofessional and we don't feel comfortable this issue was happening since the beginning of the hat they were doing sloppy work there's no way that we were going to push those products to you guys we did not want to get low quality and we told you guys since the beginning they were not answering us they were just jumping deadlines keep in mind that we hired a team two days in a row to go ahead and take pictures for promos they weren't ready with the shirts so we just decided to go ahead and cancel business with them unfortunately when we did that they got very upset they sent us messages they called us they told us all these crazy things they just completely said we're gonna go ahead and send you an email this bs email and in return they went and they kept the shirts and they also kept $23,000 and to this day we've been sending them emails that we send them messages and they have not responded to us they didn't just keep the $23,000 but on top of that they also kept 300 of our hats that we have the thing that really really started affecting us it wasn't the fact that they went and they kept all the money they weren't just messing with us but they were also messing with you guys many of you guys didn't get the right proper hats you guys didn't get the color hats or the right orders and obviously it was affecting you guys so it got to the point that we could not keep doing business with them so with all that being said they took advantage of us because you know we're new these guys these shady guys you know saw three immigrant kids trying to start up a business trying to start a movement and they took advantage of us because you know we're new we're new to the game till this day it's been a month guys we have not gotten twenty three thousand dollars back we have not gotten our blank tees we even told them bro like you guys can keep the twenty three thousand bro just give us our blank tees so we can make the products elsewhere and just drop the merch for you guys we were blessed and very fortunate to meet new people the right team we are just three immigrants trying to start up a business it hurts especially because it was fellow hispanics you get me but we're not here to bash on nobody but it's just a small bump in the road when we first started up all see someone told us actually our tax had told us like it's just a matter of time before someone tries to screw you i'm brand new to this guy like it's so foreign to us to all of us it's foreign like a business for someone trying to take advantage of us i guess that's part of life sadly hopefully yeah continue to support us you toxicos and toxicas all nine percent of you how like we said this is a family even if we haven't met you you're like family to us you support us you support our dumbasses we love you guys we can't do much about this situation yet all we could do is continue and you try to push out the best content possible. I'm a true believer that one door closes, another one opens. We've been blessed to be guided in the right direction with the right people, the right team. That is now going to be handling the merch. We're actually going to be dropping merch June 13th. That's the new date. This is going to be hopefully our first and only time that we do a pre-sale. As you guys know, if you guys bought our hats when we dropped our hats, we want you guys to get your products, your hats right away. Unfortunately, we're left with no choice for this drop. If you guys want to support us June 13th, whenever that drops, we really, really, really would appreciate it. We understand if you can't, regardless, just appreciate any support you guys give us. If you give was a like on the video comment if you just watch this that goes a long way by the way that's mm -hmm. just a simple yes. like this wouldn't be possible without you june 13th it will be a pre-sale hopefully it's the first and last time pre-sale takes a little just a tad bit longer to get to your house but we promise as soon as you guys order it we're gonna be on our ass to get that shit done so you guys can get it right away we love you for your support hope you continue to support us and i think that's it let's get straight into the video dance cave ladies and gentlemen we're going to shy town shy town Day has came, ladies and gentlemen. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Wherever you're watching us from, whatever time it is, we're going to Shy Town, Shy Town. Uh, Bibs, you ready? I just called Chief Keith. What did him are like this? He said, "Don't come over here." You know who else said that? The United the States. United States. <laughs> <laughs> and hey, you know who else came again? My girl. Hey yo, what the fuck? How much you put you in for the gas? Don't even start that. 
Either ass, grass, or cash. You feel me? No one rides for free. Los Angeles, California gas prices for y'all guys. Well, well, well. Right now we're on the way to go pick up Brandom. I got my boy Diego right here. Yo, what you got on though? Hey, he got that shit on. Material's kind of crazy on this. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm mean, not putting that shit in my whole life. It's in that hole. Buenos dias, Pichurri. Do people know about that joke yet? Like, why we call them Pichurris? <laughs> nah. Pop up the clip. Pichurris, que bueno verte, Pichurris. No, but I mean Pichurris, Pichurris. Pichurris. I need shorts. Come on, take a Cheetah print pillow neck. It was on sale, man. Oh, I left mine, bro. Oh, you can uh, rest on this one. I'm tired, but I'm excited. It's like when you get that 3 a.m. text. You know you're gonna fuck. You still tired. <laughs> Chicago, we're coming. Got a fat load waiting for y'all. Here we come at Chicago, Chi Town. We here once again. I'm shedding bricks. How about no feeling though? I'm feeling good. I just want to know whose daughter I'm gonna treat out. Uh, I'm gonna take care of them. I'm gonna love them. I'm single until this video drops. After that, it's GG's for the demon. Once again, passing by my old job. If this shit doesn't work out, best believe I'm gonna be back right there making TikTok videos again. Here we go again. Oh, oh, shut up. Oh shit. Here we go again. One of the TSA members was mad. He's like, you gonna tell him what you said? And I'm thinking, what? What did he say? He said he's stronger than you. Oh, it's okay, man. He's stronger than me. I don't care. It's not that deep to me. And my heart sank to my ass. This is the furthest Felipe has ever been from California. If you get homesick, you're kind of it's not like Las Vegas. Like you can't just be like, I'm gonna just drive back at three in the morning. Motherfucker wanted to drive back at three a.m. Yes, he was like, bro, I just want to go home, man. I'm homesick as fuck. But we drove back at three in the morning. I am no longer the CEO of the eggs. I would not like to be referred triple D demon. Diegs or SSK Diegs. That's what they used to call me. Slow Stroke King Diegs. Whatever y'all want to call me in the comments. Mendig Diegs. Slow Stroke King Diegs. CEO Diegs. We could just call him Mandilon Diegs. I'm not Mandilon. Four hours. I just realized it right now. We'll talk to the pilot again. See if he gets you in the front. There's no space. I swear. Everybody's looking at me like a dumbass. I put the things up and I guess you can open the, the things when they're closed already because that's people stuff. So I went to go look for another one. And then the whole family came in and they're talking to me a different language I don't understand. And I was trying to tell them to go through because I was like this tight. Basically, I got yelled at. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh damn, that's the ocean? I've never seen that. Oh, I've never flown that way. That's crazy. Why are we going through the ocean? I thought these birds were stepping their game up, man. Hey, you think there's some bow bow bows in here? I heard we could get drinks. Well, it's so bright up here. And I still don't understand how a metal tube can do this. It's just a metal tube up here, man. 40,000 feet in the air. Last week I was flying first class. This week we're flying spirit. Life is all about balance. <laughs> 7.26 in the morning. We have not had breakfast yet, but we are having drinks. You heard it? You can have as many as you want. <laughs> two and two. Oh, she's talking about coffee. Two perfect margaritas. Two perfect margaritas. They don't put like chamoy on the rib. Okay, okay that's only ice. <laughs> Famous buzz balls. I feel like these shits kind of weak. They say that because of the elevation, you get drunk either faster or you get more drunk. Hey, in this channel, we're the Mythbusters. So everything to the test. There's my protein shake to wake up. I gotta wake up the bubbles. I wish the CEO could have some, but he fell asleep. He took your pillow neck. Bro, he doesn't wake up till his drunk as fuck. Like, yo, what y'all doing? <laughs> Round three. Yes, sir. Captain just did an overhead announcement saying that the weather's too bad in Chicago to land. They closed off the runways because it's thunder and lightning and all this, which means we're gonna have to land into Detroit right now. Look, Felipe doesn't even know what's happening. Look at him, look at him. Uh, just get ready, yeah, we're about to land in a little. Felipe knocked out through the entire announcement. He thinks we're about to land into Chicago. Wait till he finds out we're landing in Detroit. Hey, would it be fucked up if we tell him we're landing in Mexico? <laughs> just put my maps on ETA 25 minutes, guys. See y'all there. Got my eye for all those two drinks we got, bro. They did they wonders, huh? Yeah, see? If I was a pilot, I would have treated that shit like my Nissan. If my fucking gas is even at the E, bro, I'd just be like, I don't know why I planned this shit can push for another 250 miles. The pilot's just a bitch, he's not doing it right. Thank God, you just have a center, not a plane. We're gonna mess with Felipe. We're gonna tell him we landed in Canada. It was an emergency landing because the plane had to refuel. You know what I think about every time that I'm on an airplane? Like World War II, when they used to be like fighter jets. It's I'd crazy. be a demon. Straight tables need to be out. And stop videoing. From the pictures, it looks a little different. Michael Jordan lived out here, right? Because he was part of the Chicago Bulls. Michael Jordan loves to gamble. So the guy be casinos here. Shit finna get wicked, man. I have a hit of blackjack, I'm gonna go like this. Jordan's 
Chicago, Illinois. All right, ladies and gentlemen, unfortunately, we did land here in Detroit. And the cab turned off the fast and we fell that in. We can just refuel and be on our way to Chicago. We will keep you up. We do apologize for the inconvenience again. Yeah, you, didn't tell me. you were sleeping, we didn't want to. Just act American. What happened? Emergency landing. We ran out of fuel. We ran out of fuel. Hey, Motherfucker was whipping it. Motherfucker was zooming. <laughs> 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 I had the AC blessing in the front. No way, I thought we were already here. But the good thing is we don't have to get off the plane. Like, you don't have to go through customs or anything. Stop bringing that up. Yo, we just landed in Detroit. We're diverse here. Homeboy's like, yo. What's my up? Pulled up? And he's like, bro, I wanted to go to Chicago to see y'all. But it's crazy you guys came to Detroit, so. Hey, I gotta say something. They make part of you because you're short, but you guys are about the same height, doesn't yeah. it? Thank you, bro. Right. bro. Nah, about okay. time someone says it, bro. <laughs> Look at the different POV, bro. Alberto. Oh, you can call me Beto. Alberto, el que te dejó el culo abierto. It was the other guy, el chinito. Oh, our roommate, Evan? Yeah. <laughs> he's at home, man. Heading back to Chicago. Chicago now. They say it's about a 40 or 45 minute flight. I just feel bad for the people that are there waiting for us. I don't know how many people really pulled up to the mall, but it doesn't matter because even if it's one person that's out there waiting for us, take the time out of the day to go to the mall and wait for us. As soon as we get out of the flight, we're going straight there. We can go and meet the beautiful supporters. Felipe, as you guys can tell, is pissed. Any words, Leaps? Now Chicago's ready for us. We're on the way, guys. Stay safe. We'll be right there. As you guys know, we are still on a budget, huh, Lee? By the way, guys, if you guys saw me mad earlier, I was not mad. That's called a look. You're about to get f***ing deported. About 300 feet the wrong way. <laughs> We're now in Chicago. We are with my boy, Justo. Justo yo. in the cut. Yo, what up? Justo is one of our supporters. He hit us up, and he's like, yo, if you guys ever come to Chicago, let me know. I'll take care of y'all. I'll pick you guys from the airport. You can stay at my crib. The whole nine <laughs> yards, bro. The whole nine inches. <laughs> We're about to head over to Woodfield Mall. We are supposed to pull up at 1.30. It's currently like 4. So I don't know if people are still gonna be there. Unfortunately, the whole thing with the flight kind of messed everything up. But regardless, we we're gonna go pull up there because Felipe said he has to buy some shit at Louis Vuitton, Gucci. I, I, said, I said I need to go buy pants from H&M. Shout out to you for coming and offering your services, bro. Yeah, I got y'all, bro. <laughs> about to turn out. Hell yeah. You know? I told him he's gonna be with us wherever we go. He's gonna pull up. With hey, it's your birthday. You're turning 21, aren't you? Tomorrow. Bro. Yeah. yeah. Tomorrow's his birthday. It's his 21st birthday. So we're gonna try to celebrate tonight. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe Sunday. Whenever we do, you guys are gonna remember just so by the end of this vlog. I see a bunch of Doxy goes, gang. They got the hat on too. Yeah. How we doing? Right on pack on deck, triple T. Come on, too. Reach. He got me the hand grenades, man. Maybe check this shit out, man. Y'all too, bro. Let's go drink somewhere. Nah, this shit's hard. Everybody got the fucking hat. That shit got me so hyped. Oh, God, God. Oh, God. Yeah, I was doing my research. I was trying to find the seat on man. Oh, I ain't 93% male audience. It's right here. This is how it looks, man. Yeah. Nah, bro, what's in that bag? What's up, bro? This is my girlfriend. Nice to meet you. Felipe! What's up, bro? What's up, bro? We brought you guys homemade tamales, mama. Oh, no way! I love the food. I'm hungry, yeah. What is this? Don't open it right here, bro. Another one? Another new one. What's that? Nah, who's the eyes This is my mom. Oh, my you know what she was waiting since 11 a.m. I think it's only right. I take her out shopping, maybe get her some shoes. I think that's right. I think that's right. Let's go, let's go treat her, let's go treat her. We told you to hide your Thea from Brandon. Y'all don't listen. However many people we got her up, let's go and, and sit down and drink and shit. <laughs> That's all I need, man. <laughs> hey, we about to pack Michael Kors out. Hey, how we do it, guys? This beautiful lady over here is getting a bag today. ¿Qué quieren? ¿Cuál bolsa? ¿Qué mira? ¿Qué le gusta? ¿Una bolsita? ¿Algo así? Man, I need to be a tía for you. This is good because we got the cell section over here. ¿Ya no miró? ¿No miró las otras? Wait, she already found one? She's been like this. Lo pequeño vale. ¿Ves? Lo pequeño es valioso. Oh, fucking cheese, man. Be a gentleman, would you? Yeah. The one, huh? <laughs> I think we're taking this one over here, guys. We clarified that that was on Brandon's tab, huh? Oh, wait, not that one, see? Ah, I'm just fucking with it. It's on my tab. Oh, big boy. Lo que no vea mi esposo, el más guapo. No me sabía los nombres, el papi chulo, el ojito lindo, sin muerto. Remember, guys, tax purposes. Bro, you know who you're in my. Bro, did you ever watch um, Sweet Life on, on Deck, bro? Oh my god, I know who you're talking about. <laughs> bro, do you know who I'm talking about? No, yo 
se afinó. Era conocerlos y la verdad, y él les puede decir, es el grupo que yo sigo que empecé. Muchas en gracias. He visto otros, pero la diferencia de ustedes es que trabajan afuera, hacen afuera y otros nada más adentro y no. No, no, gusta mucho no María, es que la verdad yo sé que nunca, esto no era su intención ni nada de eso, pero es algo de que usted estuvo esperando, canceló sus planes y todo para sí. tomar su tiempo de su día para estar con nosotros sí. y la verdad que es algo hermoso. No, no, muchas gracias. Es algo hermoso, María. Lo mejor. Gracias, bueno, let's go. Let's go, sí. You know what this reminds me of? You ever seen the movie Selena? Where Selena pulls up to the mall? Oh. Everybody comes, that's, this is how it reminds me of. Yeah. Okay. I feel like I'm back home with my mom. This makes me feel happy. I get homesick a lot, guys, so this makes me feel like generally happy. That's a different way to see. Look at this. Perfect. Alright, so that's the one. Telling Diego that after this, to go to the parking lot, we can get a little bit of that buzzy in our system, get a little loose. Make a circle. Uh, Long hard week. Come on, Diego! Hey. If you're driving, please don't drink. Yeah. I didn't know that in you out, big bro. <laughs> We're going together. I'm going. Oh. 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 Hey, they're calling Diego out because the CEO right here be the type of motherfucker go up to the front of the line and be like, hey, Google me. I would never <laughs> say that. <laughs> Man, why are they asking about the girl? <laughs> <laughs> Which girl? <laughs> Love I, I would have brought you, but, but remember you said you had that condition where you really can't fly? I would have brought it. Shout out to Stephanie, that's my girl. <laughs> no, they about Stephanie! Who's Steph? Damn, you're still getting leaked like that? Yeah, you are. Shout out there. Stephanie. Whoa, What's your name? Adrian, Adrian. Adrian, man. How many letters is that? Six letters? <laughs> Six seconds. <laughs> Oh, shit. Just stop trolling Brandon, that's just getting back to me, bro. Oh my god, look at this Toxico. Don't be adding in. Hey, hey, we're outside with interest right here, too. This is right here, man. Oh, 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 oh. That's too bright, bro. Oh, what the fuck? There's a little bit left, finish it off. A little bit? Hey, make sure he gets home safe, man. Now, for if you need Uber, we got you. It's on you? It's on you. They might get the climb midway, they might tell you to keep it walking. No, man, hey, this shit got the climb, man. You got to keep it walking. How are you? How are you? What's up, bro? <laughs> Wherever we're staying, I'm gonna just knock out. Let's go, bro, man. Hey, go, bro. Hey, go. Cheers, cheers. Wait, what time you got here? 11. AM? Yeah. Yo, yo. Hey. Shout out to Big Sips, bro. Oh, I got him because of them. Ya estoy, mira. Mucho mejor. Thank you, I appreciate that. Hey, yo, hey, that's 
it's different type of motion right there, man. We got arrested. You guys look amazing. Look at this, man. Oh, play. Wow. Hey, let's go. Hey, we don't want no smoke. Hey, you tall, man. Hey, rest them yeah. officer. So these are my personal. Uh, I forgot to have these on. Why am I blushing right now? Ah. As a man, these are some I handsome know, ass cops, gang. No pity, though. We appreciate you guys. Guys, love you guys. Thank you so much for showing up. Nah. Hey, this motherfucker pulled the DAs on leave. Nah. How you gotta do me like that, bro? Hey, after this, we're going. Where you guys going? Where you guys going? Uh, yeah. Yeah. We're going to the Mayan? Mayan? Love. I'm out, guys. I'm not getting deported out here. Oh, that shit was crazy, bro. I didn't expect that many people to show up. There were so many people that pulled up, bro. There was people that drove literally an hour, hour and a half to come see us. Big shout out to Maria, bro. She was there since 11 a.m. and we pulled up at like 3.30 p.m. Man, I love you, Maria, but that bag was 530 bucks. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I showed him make cry, bro. Bro, we're in a different state, gang. Hey. I've never been this far from home and people pulled up. They told me, yo, bro, I'm an hour 30 away. People that drove two hours to bro, come say what's up, bro. here for us, bro. I told my mom and she's like, man, do you but also, I'm like, bro, I'm being so serious, bro. This shit would not be possible without your guys' support. I'm a little drunk right now, and that's why I'm not driving, obviously. I love y'all so much. They said they woke up at 6 in the morning to make tamales for us. Where's the tamales at? I love you guys so much. We are in Chicago, Sueños Music Festival. We are here. Y'all boys ready or what? I'm excited, man. man. I'm lit. Look, I got the buzzy right here, and I got a best friend right over here. It's a torta, and that's a toxic. Right, yeah, yeah, here you go. I'm a little hungover, hungry, and horny, man. I got the triple H on me, but. Man, this trip, there's a lot of triple everything. So we're looking for the triple T's. Brandon, you're with the triple H's today? Mm. I'm giving triple D's. What's that mean? Demon. Yeggs in the building, feel me? I'm in Chicago, I'm, I'm, man! I'm in a great mood, I'm hyped, I'm hungover too, I'm Triple H. Mm. I'm about to pedigree your shit, I'm to the bed and just, mm, mm, mm. I'm chilling, man. No, you hey, don't like this? No. Look, look at, imagine getting the pedigree to those views. Now I'm more of a tombstone power driver, just, <laughs> We're about to head out to the festival. Y'all ready or what? Yes, sir. Well, let's start it with this, man. Boom. Mm. Down like butter. Mm. Pichurris. Pichurris is going crazy with the oh, shot. Damn. Damn. Come on, it's your consent. Give me a second to all the leche noche. Man, let's go to the festival. Brandon, you ready? Can't believe I'm here. There's so much ass. Nah. So, what the? There's a lot of ass here. I just don't got enough dick. Oh, man, we here. We already got love right here. You better put me on the block. Hey, hey, Nick Mayer Cena. Nick Mayer Cena. Nick Mayer Cena. What about Nick Mayer Cena? He played soccer. He played Asco. Nah, he was raw. Uh, Finish the beat, boss, yo. I'm a torta I'll pounder off one beat, boss. I'll do that shit sober. No, he's, he's got the right up. Hey, Zan won't dance you right won't, there. Won't, he won't, won't do it. He might see you a be bouncing that shit like this. No. Edit that shit out, please. Hey. Nah. Oh, what is Deep the tongue game, though. If you gonna throw it back, throw it back right. Nah. <laughs> One beatbox with the T.O. Morning was talking to me, he's like, hey man, you guys went from construction to YouTube and all this. How y'all doing? Because I can't do it. You already limiting yourself. You say you can't do some. Don't limit yourself, bro. If you're telling yourself you can't do something already, you already got that mentality trapping yourself into like this little circle, bro. You gotta not have that mentality, bro. Step out of that shit, bro. Let's go. Oh, shit, this shit toxic, huh? <laughs> I love you. Girl audience, should we make an I love toxicos? I know a toxic woman I when I see one. one. There's a lot of toxic out there. But should we make you one? I love y'all so much. Ah, this is crazy. I love it. I low key thought he was taller. I've been getting this shit all day, bro. I'm not that tall, gang. I'm 5'8. Oh, you can never get enough of this. He said, yo, take a little sip of my drink. I told him, bro, I don't take sips. I take the whole shit. Pause. Hey, there's only one person that has the right to take this. Leave. Hey, shout out to Steven, man. Yeah, man. Hey, low key, these honey packs taste better when you're drunk. That shit tastes good. Nah, my poor dick, man. I'm giving out demon dick all weekend, man. The best in Chicago right now. Man, I love Chicago. Brandon like 35, so he probably took a boomerang on his Instagram. Thinking you got me right where you want me. I tell him, oh, 
bitches dug dug Sending them shots, we send them back and Ain't really bout that Run, it's always bounce back What you got from me? This shit makes me emotional though, I went from being a regular barber to a horny barber. I love y'all. Hey, somebody here got an I love dogs in his hat. In Alabama. The first and only Latino based fraternity in Alabama. I want them to come out. Hey, is there in there? Everywhere, bro. Alabama! Here I come! We love our Mexicans out here, man. I just found another I love dogs because I. I've been looking for you! 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 We lost our ticket! It's a pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh, you're happy doing it? Oh, let's go! Do it, do it! Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it! I really never had friends like him and Felipe. I appreciate you guys so much for fucking taking take, taking care of me. Look, Liquid Death. Hey, hey, Liquid Death, hit us up for a little sponsorship. Day two of Sueños Music Festival is today. I'm excited, I'm hype. I'm gonna be honest, bro. I didn't think I could get any more hungover than yesterday, but today I'm fucked up, man. Hey, hey, hey. I don't feel good. My tummy hairs, my lele pancha. I'm a little homesick, but I'm good, man. That's the good thing about Los Chicos Tokes, because we're here to break records, you feel yeah, me? Yeah. Hey, today, we do that same shit again. Run that shit back. Hey for Brando, hey, man. I hope I can make it back to LA in one piece. Huge thank you to all the people that came up to us yesterday. Showed us crazy love. Hopefully I'll do this shit again today because we love meeting y'all. If I can talk to every single person that watches, I will stand here and do this. We try our best. I was leaving the club yesterday fucking shitting myself, bro. I shit outside of McDonald's. I shit <laughs> in the club and I'm like, nah, bro. I gotta go back to the hotel and take a mean ass shit. It took me five minutes to get out the club. My lift is mad as fuck at me because I'm not outside. And then they're like, yo, can we get a flick? Right when I'm back at Hype Out, I'm like, of course, bro. I'm like, can we make it quick? And they're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm like, I'm sorry, bro. I just really gotta take a shit, bro. <laughs> hey, so I don't want you to think I'm a dickhead. What? I literally told them, I was like, bro. And I let that bro I take the meanest my side right now. <laughs> if not, man, I'll be like, take it slow, man. Be gentle with me. <laughs> Swan news was insane, yeah, bro. Yeah. I just cannot believe it. I literally called my mom. No, I was like, red. I'm like, we couldn't even walk. She's like, me vale verga. Nah, <laughs> nah, 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 she nah. She, was, she couldn't believe it either. ¿Por qué te quieres mirar? Nada más te miras como un pendejo. I'm like, <laughs> my mom, thank you. Speaking of love, hella love in the lobby. Should we go show love? Oh. On the vlog? Let's go vlog it. Let's go vlog it. I heard we're ready to take the shot. Who got the buzzer? We got the boys. They, they showed us love right in the lobby. We might get kicked out the hotel. Can we take a quick little shot here, bro? I appreciate it, bro. Thank you. Nobody got it, man. It's all good, bro. We talk. We're ready to go get some food, bro. Y'all have fun. Y'all have a good day, bro. Appreciate it. Bro. Take, take care, care, guys. Happy birthday to He got that shit on. Oh, yeah. Nice. Presidential ass fing outfit, bro. 22. 22. Ooh. You better give a girl 22 back shots uh, tomorrow. Yeah. My record of 19. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, y'all. Have a good one. I'm hungover as hell. What about you, Big Motion? I'm done, bro. And the lot Yeah, bro. A little bit in my stomach. So you can do now. I'll put a little bit in your stomach. Sorry, guys. Yeah, drink or not? Man, I'm drinking, man. I'm done. Even the thought of alcohol right now makes me want to gag. That shit's good as fuck. I'm shaking, bro. So we just got back to the hotel, about to meet one of our supporters. Guys, I feel amazing. The hangover is gone. I feel good. I threw up a little bit, came up, brushed my teeth, and I checked my underwear because I think I was just pushing a little too hard. We're about to meet up with a boy right now who owns a restaurant. We were supposed to pull up to the restaurant and then something popped up and we couldn't go. They wanted to have like a little, man, I guess you could say like a meet and greet there, you know, pull up and meet you guys. But something popped up and we couldn't make it. We told our supporter, yo, come through our hotel. We really want to meet you because he posted a whole reel like, yo, can you guys please get Chico Stokes? He goes to come to the restaurant. And we saw it and we were going to pull up, but unfortunately, something 
things popped up and we couldn't make it. But he's here now. We're gonna meet him. He's been showing a lot of love. So pop up his Instagram right here. If you're in the Chicago area, go check out my boy's restaurant. We're back actually getting a review. We're on the streets bringing some food. And you know me, man. I love to eat, man. You love to eat? Yeah. Dick? Yeah. <laughs> what up, bro? Nice to meet you, big dog. Good, good, good. good. Deep ass, ass boys. Yeah, how you man. doing, man? <laughs> man, man? Nice to meet you, man. Everyone's saying, man. You gotta go to Marisco's El Playa. Very good. Restaurant, baby. Respectfully and humbly. Respectfully. Respectfully. Oh, what you same. get us, bro? A player pack. We got ceviche camarón, ceviche mixto. So you get ceviche pescado, ceviche camarón, consume, okay. which is like for the cruda. It's like our shrimp, our consume base. So it's our huge batch we make, and then it's just the consume seat that's left over. Okay. But man, let me just start by saying thank you for me coming by to see you guys, man. It's been a my fault, bro. I really apologize. No, 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 I love where I'm from, but where I'm from. I don't even want to cry at you, bro. Nah, no, you're good, bro. You're good. It's been a day. It's been a day. I had these glasses on and shit, too, bro. Nah, yeah. Hey, we can do this shit off camera, bro. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. Let me get myself nah, together. Yeah, so, uh, I used to apply at 2880 West Cermak Road on Cermak and Marshall Boulevard in Little Village. The gem and hub of Mexican culture in Chicago on 2880 West Cermak Road. Born and raised, 20 Dern and Rockwell. No, I'm not a gang bang. I might look like one, but I don't gang bang. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Only gang I'm a part of is the Playa gang. You know what I'm saying? We're right there on uh, Marisol La Playa, 2880 West Cermak Road, 773-801-1870. This is extension of myself, my Person, who I am, family, we've been in Marisco's game. Like, we love seafood so much like, since I was a kid. So, everything here is like a part of the person I am and who I am type of shit. That's amazing. Yeah, hey, bro, you brought everything but the hose. Where the hose? <laughs> Oh, I'm trying to be good. I've been celibate since the beginning of the year. I broke over her in the beginning of the year. Cause oh. she be talking shit, throwing dirt on me, but we get passing those kudos silent in the light. You know what I'm saying? So throwing dirt on my own name. Shout out Drake, man. My fault, man. Hey, it's only right that we try it with you, bro. You wanna grow up with us? Down, yeah. Let's I do even, it. I haven't even ate all day. Yeah, bro. Let's, eat, bro. let's go, let's eat. Made from scratch, baby. Yeah. 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 Agua de sandia. Agua de ochata. This is actually your model. Yeah, your girlfriend for a restaurant. That's, That's part of my summer yeah. times campaign. And I got some stickers for y'all too. They're a little way, como las ponemos, you know what I'm saying? You got a girlfriend though. It's not good, man. That can't stop me from having a good time. This shit is bro. This is the world's famous langostino sauce. Ceviche de pescado. Oh. Y de camarón. No, I know. That's a little weird. Oh my um, god, bro. I Shout out. Ooh, it smells like a pussy. Oh. <laughs> bro, I don't think pussy supposed to smell like that, okay? It it's fish. Fault. It's for all the toxic guys and toxic ones, bro. You're teasing us. I love to tease. This is just the chicken wings. Oh. Damn. No, I mean, a lot of <laughs> oh, I'm about to suck the meat out of the bone, man. Like someone I know. Shout out Diego, man. I don't know. Man. Shout out to my boy for coming through with that fire ass food, bro. We you just got said the best that. shrimp in town. Best Thank bro. you guys for being uh, who you guys are. Aspiring Latinos, aspiring Mexicans throughout the country, Chicago, and throughout the world. Need more of that. Oh, Asa supporting Asa, you know what I'm saying? saying? Let him know about the pod, bro. Shout out my boy Francisco, Shy Bay's Photo Poppy, doing our C Sabo podcast. Yeah, for sure. connecting all different walks of life Latinos, Mexicans, everybody together in the Chicago land area. Creating a little community for all of our people. That's what it is, baby. Yes, sir. Connecting with this. No, man. On that note, we'll pick up the vlog and swing. Sadly, Carla is not really that much gambling. I'm gonna gamble my relationship today. Really? Really? What kind of woman do you love? Slugs, man. Let's go inside. The other day, Diego put me on blast. I didn't know my national anthem. I know the Mexican national anthem. And now, I have the beautiful Ecuador. Hey, hey, hey. I'm like, yo, what's your national anthem? He goes, hey, uh, I know. I it. haven't been there since I was five. I know it, bro. He goes, like, and dude. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot. It, bro. I, ain't gonna lie. I know how it goes, but I forgot again. Aluma sexy ass is on stage right now singing. Aluma, quítate la camisa! Quítate la! Quítate la! <laughs> so basically, because Brandome's here, the whole festival got canceled. Everybody was rushing Brandome. Couldn't handle my horniness, man. But nah, it's the fuck out of here. The locals from Chicago are saying there's nothing, man. Like, stay nearby. So I'm gonna stay nearby. Hopefully, if we get back in. Well, I'm not leaving without seeing Pencil Pluma. Y'all know my Pencil Pluma? I know, I know my Hassan. Hey, bro, hey, where you at, bro? I got bitches away for you. I'm right here by the tent. I love the new whip, bro. Ain't a Damn, man, low key, this shit starting to pick up. The weather is bad here in Chicago, so we gotta head back to the hotel. We came, we saw, we conquered. We did not conquer anything. We're leaving defeated. You made it this far into the vlog. We get to see it in our face. We're ready to just go home. I'm ready to party some more, man. Huge <laughs> shout out to everybody that came up to us and showed us crazy love. That was Bro. insane. You guys see us out in public. Keep coming up to us. We love meeting you guys. If we didn't meet you, we're really sorry. We really, really tried. We were in GA. Like, we were with the crowd. You can't even say we were VIP. I don't like, want to hear that bullshit. 
that nah. uh, Chico Soto goes to jail. We were with GA, man. GA. And you know what GA stands for? Getting ass. Good. We're just catching that shit all night. <laughs> Where are we just though? <laughs> <laughs> Quick shout out. Let me show you guys the man of the hour. Oh, that boy is? Justo, bro. Hey, he made this shit possible. Bro, he literally made Chicago feel like home. Yeah. So really shout out to Justo. But before we shout out Justo, shout out to the supporter, Toxicas and Toxicos. And my boy Justo, a little demon, man. Hit up my boy Justo. <laughs> hey, how tall are you? Look, like, Brando, stand right next to him. He's tall. <laughs> he's tall. You know he's tall. You know what they say about tall guys. I was just spending your 21st birthday with the Chicos Toxicos, man. Shout out to the Chicos Toxicos, man. This weekend was a movie. Yeah. Oh. We was in the section with all the toxic guys. Yeah. <laughs> no, we wasn't. No, we wasn't. Huge shout out to a brand known Diego and Felipe for bringing me along. They didn't have to, but y'all glory to God. Thanks to them. Get this video to 5,000 likes and we're flying our boy Justin out. Yeah. So we can show him LA, Los Angeles. Let's bring out my boy Justin to LA, man. Come Once on. again, we love you guys so much. If you tuned in this far into the video, drop a little comment. Just say, just go out to LA. Mm -hmm. Or stay toxic. That one no, too. That was hard like too. That New merch dropping in June. These guys showed every single supporter each individual second of their time whatever they do on camera they do it behind camera they're real ones for sure we love you guys see you guys next week love you guys love you. Oh, we leave. Oh. Oh. bro my dad's crying it's insane the support y'all giving us bro love you guys so much now peace, <laughs> peace. Ah.